All right, guys, y'all know how this works. If I talk to the camera, I need you to watch rods. So, really, you got to understand if I'm going to look back and forth. I don't want to miss a bite. But uh, I took the time to film an intro on the way up here in the truck. I really don't think that introduction is going to be very applicable. I had hoped to call this video a West Point Lake Bridge Monster because I'm fishing close to the bridge. Well, as of right now, we haven't found the monster, but we've got a lot of action. We've caught a lot of fish. I'm fixing to wrap up here, guys, and I'm doing this at the beginning. I'm still getting bit, but uh, incredible amount of fish today. No monsters, but uh, guys, it's been steady action. Let me check that raw. All right, maybe he'll pick it back up. But anyway, um, guys, you know, if you watch all my videos and you hear everything I say, you know I don't like hot weather. You know I don't like a stagnant lake. I want current. But uh, July often brings it with it a little disruption in the weather pattern. When it's hot and nasty and we ain't got enough rain to create current, when these afternoon thunderstorms start, good job. This might be a gar. That was a hard hit. All right, we're still hooked up. <laughs> anyway, these uh, afternoon thunderstorms, they will cause a bite. It will change their attitude. This is crazy, y'all. We're going to get a fish here. I'm trying to film an intro. We might change this back to Bridge Monsters. What do you think? Still feeling drag. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, big swirl. Ah. All right. So I'm going to put this at the beginning of the video, and you get to see all these other fish after this, guys. But thunderstorms early in the afternoon, you need to get to the lake in the evening because fish bite is going to be on. And, uh, Right here, the last minute, we've got another rod bouncing, and probably the, we've got the best fish of the evening right here. Oh, they must have heard me and say, heard me saying I was fixing to go. <laughs> Dog. <laughs> oh. Anyway, guys, um, so you might get to see the last fish first. That was. Fantastic. <laughs> Dog. All right, I'm going to get a weight on this, and I'm going to guess he's he's mid-low 20s, another skinny male, but whoo, that was fun. Get like a man. All right, guys, let's wrap this up with a 26-pound male catfish. He is doo dooed all over my boat. But I don't care, man. I love it when they hit hard and they rip drag and they have fun fight. Absolutely worth it. <laughs> Woo! Anyway, guys, I hope y'all enjoy the rest of this video. There's a lot of fish in this. Woo! Y'all be good. All right, guys, well, I found my fishing spot, and I'm about to deploy baits. Wind is variable. <laughs> so, uh, like I said, if I catch anything big, we'll call it West Point Bridge Monster. Uh, so, if you see this video, it means we found something. But uh, I'm not right on the bridge. 
I'm backed up probably two or three hundred yards from it. I'm in the mouth of a creek right on a hump between where this creek that gets deep and right here's the main channel and I got wind coming out of the south and coming out of the west so my boat is going like this so keeping lines out is going to be a lot of fun but uh, this is where I'm bound to determine the fish so we're going to give it a go uh, I am not using my trolling motor uh, when I fish this shell guys I think that that constant spot lock noise I think it bothers the bite so I got my anchor out that just means to play and my boat's going to be exaggerated but uh, anyway, it's hard to catch fish flapping your gums. Let's get to work. All right, hooked up. This fish was swimming with it. Still swimming with it. All right, guys, that was just a quick release on about a five pounder. That's okay. I, I mean, probably the best thing to do is to um, just pile it, and give it at least a, you know, I don't know, good 50 foot buffer. Right. You know, of live trees around it. And you can half is what they recommend, but uh, I'd go at least a tree right that's fast one because I'm from seeing something got big big steeps. Oh. Alright guys, let's get the skunk out with this channel cat. Sorry about the phone call. Sometimes work never stops. It's uh it's alright. Cell phones let us get a little work done while we're fishing, right? Let's get this dude off the hook and get another bait out there. Sitting here trying to get another one. Making sure there's bait on it. I got one going down. Doubled up. We're pretty close. I got one sitting up here at the front of the boat you can't see that's up on that flat. Real shallow. Something just pounded it. It's not a monster, but he hit hard. He hit like I like to see a blue cat hit. <laughs> oh. They eating guys, that's good news. Doubling up, guys. It's good news. All right, good hit. Let's see if we can stay hooked up. Thank you. 
still no monsters, but they are getting bigger. <laughs> God, he's been swimming with it. He's been a long way. It just come off. Nope, he's swimming upstream now. Good gracious. We got a swimmer, guys. swimming all over the river. Another decent fish. Still not the monster we're after, but Still, another, not bad. 